and we were all angry. So we decided to do actions. And it was just nice to be with everyone, you know, and, and we would do these actions. And I remember suggesting, they had this floor where all of these pharmaceutical companies and condom companies and lube companies and whatever else they could possibly throw in there under the AIDS banner. All these booths set up. And I thought, they can sell their stuff and we're all outside here we're selling safer sex. Why can't we go on to that floor? Why can't we have a boot? So I discussed this with Danny. And he said, I said, why don't we go in there and just, he said, yep. <laughs> he was game. So we told everyone else and they agreed that this was a pretty good idea. And we did it. And we, we went in and uninvited, just walk, waltzed in. We did tell the media up front that we were going to be doing this. And they were there in droves. And Danny and I began. Uh, safer sex for sale. Uh, get your safer sex here. $50 for a blowjob. And, you know, I mean, I, I said $50 because I figured we were conferencing like for like 10, 12 hours a day. I'm not going to be able to spend a good amount of time, like a half an hour at least, with a client to give them a proper blowjob. So I, that's why I said $50 as opposed to $150. Reasonable, right? <laughs> of course.